Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be trying aloe vera on my skin for five days. So aloe vera is a plant that has many benefits for your skin. Some of the benefits include reducing irritation and inflammation, helping to treat and prevent acne, and helping to treat acne scars and sunburns and just any other irritation like eczema that you can get on your skin. So first of all, I just wanna show you guys how I prepared my aloe vera for my very first day of trying aloe vera. So how I'm gonna be using it is I'm gonna wash my face first which I already had. I will insert that clip here. And then I am going to be applying the aloe vera on my face, just like a face mask. I'm gonna leave it on for about 15 minutes. I'm gonna wash it off, I'm gonna moisturize, and I will repeat that for the next five days for my PM skincare routine. So right now I will insert a clip showing you guys how I prepared my aloe vera for this video. All right, so this is what the aloe vera gel leaf looks like before I'm cutting it. It's pretty long. And when you're cutting it, you wanna start on this end because this is where it's gonna be the most fleshy so anyway i'm just gonna cut the bottom like this we're gonna try two different ways to apply this today first i'm gonna cut this in half like this and then i am going to slice it like this in the middle i'm going to try to rub it onto my skin using these things here i'm also going to try to just like take all of this stuff off put it in a cup and apply it that way i'm not sure which way will be easier so i'm gonna take a fork and try to just mash this all right so this is the consistency that i have so far i'm gonna try to mash it more because this i feel like is not mashed enough it's still pretty thick okay i'm also finding that doing this bringing it up like this kind of breaks it apart and makes it a little bit more of a mask consistency so overall my skin looks pretty good although i do have this pimple right here underneath my eyebrow which is super red i do have redness and some acne scars here and also on my chin and up here so in this video hopefully we'll be able to see these acne scars going down so first i'm just going to try applying it with this oh it actually works but it's not really putting that much on my skin. It feels very cool. Cool as in like actually temperature wise. I read that it can cool your skin. I don't know what the benefits are of cooling your skin. Ooh, it already looks really good. This is only day one. Wow. Oh my gosh, this feels really, really good. Okay, so I do want to apply this solution. I think I'm just going to use my fingers. Oh, this is going to get really yucky. Yucky. Okay, so I have this bit. Oh, wow. Ooh. One downside to this is it is very, very messy. You know what? Screw it. I'm just, I'm gonna apply it like this. It's natural. If it gets on my hair, it's really not a big deal. All right, so this is what it is. This is my first attempt. I have it all up in my mouth. If you guys have never tasted aloe vera, it tastes disgusting. But we are going to keep this on my face for 15 minutes. I will rinse it off and I will come back and it's so crazy because looking at my skin with this on my face, my skin, I feel like it's really good. It looks glowy. So it's actually been 20 minutes and I just wanna show you guys what the mask looks like once it has dried. Obviously it doesn't like feel like a regular mask just because it is just aloe vera, but it feels a little bit like a regular mask in that when I smile or I scrunch my face up, it feels really tight and it feels like the aloe vera is like breaking apart, if that makes sense. It has completely dried on my skin except for a little bit here, which I think there was excess. So I'm going to go wash it off right now. Okay, so I've just washed it off my face. I'm now going to moisturize. So today I liked the way that it made my skin feel cool. It just felt really refreshing. And then I also liked how it just feels like a very gentle skin treatment. So with that being said, I will see you guys tomorrow on day two. Hey guys, so it's the next day and because I have some of this aloe left over from yesterday, I am just gonna use this to apply on my face just so that I don't waste any of it. So I did like how I applied it yesterday where I did this one first and then I applied the actual gel. Oh my gosh, it feels really good cool it's been sitting in the fridge for the past day and it just feels really cold and very very soothing oh my gosh this is kind of weird but i feel like if you were to take one of these maybe even a bigger one and just like rub someone's back with it cold i feel like that would feel really really good <laughs> baby do you want to try it doesn't it feel nice can you confirm that it feels nice to the audience yeah it feels like a soft sponge
Oh, wow. Okay. Thank you. Now I'm gonna take the good stuff, the goopy stuff. Extremely goopy. Goopy. By the way, I guess before I put it on, let me just show you guys my skin up close really quick. I feel like the scars up here, they look a little bit lighter, but I've just used this one time, so I don't think we're gonna see any results probably until tomorrow. There's really no way to go about doing this without being messy because it's just extremely extremely messy also one recommendation i have is to concentrate a lot of it at the top of your face because i noticed yesterday a lot of it ended up dripping down oh my god this is like insane one thing that i do feel like this aloe vera gel does is make my skin look is make my skin look glowy i have noticed that recently my skin has been looking a little bit dull but after using the aloe vera yesterday i noticed that today my skin looked a lot more glowy than usual and i also just wanted to show you guys the pimple that i had under here under my eyebrow i noticed that today it did that thing that pimples do when like the first couple days of a pimple it's just sitting under the skin and then as the pimple progresses it starts to emerge from the skin which means that it is probably going to be gone pretty soon so today was the first day that this pimple emerged from the skin so i don't know if that has anything to do with the aloe vera gel i know that aloe vera gel is healing anti-inflammatory so maybe it is helping to heal that pimple so far aloe vera is working very well on my skin 15 minutes later Hey guys, so overall today, I feel like my skin looks really good actually. The only thing that I have an issue with is that I'm getting a pimple here, but that could just be hormonal because it's like that time in my cycle, I think. In terms of my acne scarring and how the aloe vera gel is dealing with the acne scars, I feel like down here, it doesn't really seem to be doing much because these are pretty dark. It's the scars up here that I actually feel like it's having a positive impact on it really looks like those scars are going down and then the pimple that i have right here i haven't actually checked up on it so this pimple is definitely going down so hopefully it is because of the aloe vera gel i'm gonna take this part of, oh i'm gonna take this part of the leaf first i like as i showed you oh my gosh it's so cold as i showed you guys yesterday i like to use this first to sort of prep my face I feel like you could just use this alone, but I don't think that it's enough. I have like a bib on. Okay, so I'm just gonna scoop some of this with my hand because that is honestly the best way to do this and just put this on my face. All right, so I'm gonna leave this on for 15 minutes and then I will wash it off and come back. I'm really liking the results so far. It looks really, really good. And I'm just amazed at how much it appears the acne scars that I have on my forehead are fading. And I know it's definitely due to the aloe vera because in aloe vera, there are the healing properties. So yeah, it looks really good. Also the redness that I typically have right here also looks like it might be going down a little bit. Ooh, I really, really like this so i'm just gonna moisturize now and then i will see you guys tomorrow okay so i realized it looks like i'm not wearing a shirt but i have a towel here so i'll just put that up so this is now day four i'm just gonna be completely honest with you guys i didn't really feel like my skin looked that good today i'm getting some whiteheads like around my mouth right here right here and then also this thing, which is huge. I think the main thing that it's supposed to help with really is acne scarring. I don't think it's necessarily supposed to heal like active breakouts. I really need chapstick. My lips literally look like they're gonna freaking burn off my face. Okay, and I put a shirt on so it wouldn't look like I was not wearing clothes. So when it comes to the acne scars, I do really feel like the aloe vera is helping to heal that, which makes complete sense. I don't know about you guys, but to me, it just looks lighter. It's really late, but we are going to continue to do this. I was like, I'm just gonna skip today, but nope, gotta stay dedicated. Oh my gosh, it stings. You know what, maybe this aloe vera, if I like concentrate it here, it will help it to go down. I'm actually not going to apply as much. I feel like 
that much is not really needed and I'm just gonna try to focus it on the areas where I'm trying to help out my acne scars. So I'm literally just dipping it. Okay, so I just washed it off my face. It's so weird, I feel like every single time that I use the aloe vera on my face after I wash it off, my skin just looks a lot lighter. Maybe it's not necessarily that my skin is really lighter, like it's not necessarily lightening my skin, but I know that it does help with burns so I'm wondering if maybe it is helping to reduce the redness in my face, which is making my skin appear lighter. I am not sure. I do think that the pimples on this side of my face are hormone related. Also, it was my birthday this week, so I had a lot of sweets. I ate a lot of junk food. So I wouldn't be surprised if the little whiteheads that I have popping up here are caused by the fact that my diet has been absolute this week so yeah i will see you guys tomorrow which is actually the last day hey guys so it's the last day and i've already put the aloe vera on my face in some as this is drying first of all i feel like this lightened my skin as i said and second of all it lightened my acne scars it did not do much to you know reduce acne or prevent acne because i am breaking out a little bit down here which could be related to diet or hormones it didn't really do much to decrease breakouts on my face it was more so in terms of the lightening of my face and the acne scars it worked really well in that department, I guess. So I'm gonna wait 15 minutes for this to dry on my face because there is so much on my face today. It's probably gonna take a little bit longer to dry, but nevertheless, I will come back afterwards and show you guys the final result. I know that you're not supposed to like drag towels on your face like this, but I swear you cannot get this off your face by like rinsing water. So I just take a warm wet cloth and I just rub it on my face because that is the only way that this is going to come off your face. And you also just wanna make sure that it is all off of your face because although this did seem to work really well for my skin, I kind of feel like maybe it's possible that this pimple sprouted. It could have been hormones, but it also could have been the fact that the aloe vera was like really concentrated on my jawline and on my chin here. Maybe I didn't wipe enough off and maybe it caused this pimple, so just be careful. So this is what the acne scars up there look like on the final day. They look a lot lighter than day one. This is what this area looks like. I feel like this didn't really change much. If anything, it maybe got a little worse. But anyway, I did really like the aloe vera challenge. All in all, it seemed to lighten my skin as well as the acne scars. So if that's what you guys are looking for, then I would definitely recommend to try this out. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe and turn on bell notifications. If you guys wanna be notified whenever I upload, thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you guys next time.